hello friend in this video we will discuss the basic designation of uh, escape bearing okay so in the last video uh, we have discussed the basic designations are divided into uh, three sections like a uh, prefix basic designations or you can call it as a bearing series or the suffix okay so in the last video we have discussed in the thoroughly okay so in this video we will quickly understand the escape bearing designations okay so in the prefix section okay so in the prefix section you can see these type of codes are used like ic os uh, d slash w w okay so this is related with the bearing units okay oil seal bearing units stainless steel inch dimensions so this type of uh, prefix you can see over the escape bearing okay sometimes these typics are not available on the bearing okay so it will be available or it will not be available with the bearing number okay so second digit shows the bearing and the bearing number okay so the bearing which start with zero okay the digit four digit or five digit that start with zero it means that it is a dub, uh, double row angular contact ball bearing if the number is start with one so it is self uh, self aligning ball bearing okay and the number if it uh, that number is start with the two it means that the spherical roller bearing okay and likewise you can see here the different codes are used for the different types of the bearing okay so uh, if the bearing start with the six so you can see that the bearing number start with the six zero zero eight means the first digit shows the bearing type type of the bearing okay so here it is a single row deep group ball bearing and the last two digit okay the last two digit shows the internal diameter okay so here it is a z uh, zero eight means uh, last two digit we need to multiply it by uh, multiplied with the uh, with the five so that will get the internal diameter so here it is uh, eight into five it means that 40 mm uh, internal diameter okay and here in the uh, this is uh, this is the bearing the bearing uh, series and the bearing type of the bearing so this uh, uh, diagram you can see here okay so this chart okay so here we have the uh, bearing type start with the 0 1 2 likewise okay so this refers to as a, a double row angular contact ball bearing so these are the series uh, bearing series number you can see over here okay so generally this bearing designation for escape bearing it is in uh, uh, it is in three parts like uh, it it may start with the uh, alphabet or it may start with a four digit number and it may start with a five digit number okay if it is start with a five digit so the first is shows the uh, bearing type the second is shows the uh, width of the bearing and last two digits shows the uh, internal diameter of the bearing okay so like uh, so in uh, dime uh, last is the diameter series and this here is 6008 it sh first shows the bearing type and last two digits shows the internal diameter and okay so after that the bearing uh, see bearing series or the ba basic designation you can find the suffix so it is not uh, it, it is not mandatory to define all the suffix so it may be one or two okay it depends okay so uh, these are the means uh, uh, one or two you can see over the bearing not complete uh, uh, description okay see for three four like that okay any one you can find over the bearing okay so the three uh, suffix shows the in internal design and the uh, the shortcut used for the uh, internal design these are the and this is the description okay and here four shows the external design like a seal snap ring and the groove okay and these are the uh, short forms used for the uh, to define the external design okay and next one is the cage design so any of the uh, any of the uh, short, short forms are used after the uh, bearing series okay so the cage design these are the short form and these are the meanings okay so you can take the screenshot okay and uh, after the 61962 
so six one shows the material and the heat treatments okay uh, and the six two shows the uh, accuracy clearance and the preload and the quieting okay so you can see the uh, clearance uh, class over the bearing like a c1 c2 c3 so you can see on the uh, bearing uh, bearing surface okay uh, so after that the six uh, uh, six five and the six six it shows the these are the different short forms used okay uh, and the six five shows the lubrication and six six shows the other variants okay so here you can see the example here so uh, it is not always mandatory to keep all the uh, forms okay like uh, here you can see the 24013 it shows the two number okay so we have seen here there is no uh, prefix okay and in the suffix okay so in the suffix you can see the three number and the four number and the six find five number okay so likewise okay so it is not always mandatory to keep all the all the sections okay on the bearing okay so it depends on the bearing and the uh, bearing design and the bearing uh, so we, uh, value on uh, like a uh, different designs of the bearing and the different types of the bearing so it depends on the bearing okay so uh, likewise uh, so in brief we have seen the basic designation of escape bearings okay i hope uh, you uh, got some information related with the bearing designation okay so if you have any doubt you can uh, comment in the comment box and uh, 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 share this video with your friend uh, if you like it and subscribe the channel if you are new here okay so thank you for watching see you in the next video